Grandpa Newbie reporting for duty with the sister ship to yesterday's video on the Bare Bones MCPR 300, the OG sniper at factory settings with no additional attachments. As you recall, here's what I said yesterday. I'm gonna go all in for aim down sight and then we'll test it out tomorrow. Done already? So let's take a look at the configuration and see if I improved A down sight speed and considered flinch. The KR Marauder 9 riser damage is the same range, about the same as his fire rate, recoil control and accuracy. The bullet velocity is slightly less and red on this chart means that not quite as good as the bare bones green means better than the bare bones and highlighted green means much better than the bare bones and i'll direct you to the middle where it says aim down sight speed i improved that by 177 milliseconds that's the difference between waiting all night and waking up in the morning i'm telling you that is night and day difference the other major difference is the ads movement speed and the sprint to fire speed at 122 milliseconds seconds better for the configuration. I'm not worried about any of the red. The recoil control is about the same. The range is still way out there and the hip fire, if I'm hip firing with this weapon, then the battle's not going well for me. As far as mobility, much better with the configuration. I also took away five rounds, so that helps significantly with the ADS movement speed, 21%, the rest of the movement speeds, but definitely the handling, 13% better. On on the ADS speed. Reload quickness, you'd expect it to be better, so that's really a wash. Sprint to fire speed, 35% better. The 17 and a half inch Orca Barrel, again, that went for ADS speed. That's what I said I was targeting. The FSS Merc Stock. ADS speed, crouch movement speed, which I don't really care about, and that's where the slight hit to the recoil came in. Not an issue. Finally, the Cronin Cheetah Grip. Again, ADS slightly, but look at that. 22% on the sprint the fire speed that is awesome another hit with the recoil but hey speaking of recoil let's take a look at it in the shooting range first hip fire <laughs> it just slowly climbs its way straight up like it did with the bare bones now let's aim down sight and see what happens not controlling it you got plenty of time to bring it back down finally let's go ahead and control the recoil Yeah, so there really is no controlling gun kick on a sniper, and the recoil itself, you're helped by the weapon pulling it back down for you. Let's take the MCPR 300, the OG weapon as we've configured it, onto the field of battle, see how it did for Grandpa, and see what it did to Grandpa's enemies. Let's go. First map is shipment, which is the great separator of snipers from pud knockers like uh, maybe grandpa here. But I do like sniping shipment and I can already tell the aim down sight speed which is more than 200 milliseconds faster in this configuration is helping out old grandpa. Also the movement speed. I always like coming up behind people with a sniper because you got time to aim, unless one of your teammates is going to gack them. No, oh, there's, uh, there's a hound dog. Put one in his. Oh, there's hound dog again. Hound dog is Elvis. Oh, Grandpa took on too many people there. Ooh, bad guy. Bad guy alert, and let's get out the Renetti and tell him we love him. Give him the very best. So I, I think the MCPR is pretty pretty powerful weapon if you consider more than 400, almost 500 damage to the head, and the upper torso damage is way up there. It's mostly going to be a one-shot kill now. <laughs> I just get a hit marker, and it looked like maybe I hit him in the arm or something. There's the flaming whatever coming at me. Ooh. That's what Grandpa's head feels some, some Saturday mornings. When I was younger, oh, there's a hit and a miss, but let's pull out the Renetti and get the hit again. There's a fighter pilot running around. He belongs up, up in the sky, not uh, 
not running around on the ground with an oxygen mask. If you ran around like that with your visor down, oxygen mask hanging off, there's a miss. You would be in trouble. So you can access targets pretty quickly or acquire. There's a guy just spraying. I think that was Hound Dog Elvis. Oh, Hound Dog Elvis. There ain't nothing but a hound dog crying. Okay. Whoa. Obligatory knifer came after me, and that was a good one. Grandpa's happy about that win. We did okay. The weapon did spectacularly. I mean, I naturally aim high with marksman rifles and snipers. I aim a little lower with... Other types of weapons, ARs. There. I'm not as confident sniping on stash house because I'm worried the police are going to come looking for the stash. So I don't move quite as quickly in stash house as I do on shipment and I get a thermite in the back of the head. That's what happens. I tell you, when you're on a small map and you're not moving, you're attracting bullets like flies somebody's gonna stick one in your ear there comes rubber man the human eraser the pay to win skin from modern warfare 2 i don't even know what that guy is a canary so as far as a classic sniper roll the mcpr is good and there i am hard scoped i didn't hard scope near as much in on shipment but like i said i'm not as comfortable on this map plus if guys are going to come <laughs> into my field of view why not Let's see if there's anybody down there yep there's oh is that a that's collateral cool well, i told you it's powerful and if you aim high air force if you aim high you're gonna you're gonna put it through them and the almost 500 damage to the head no, oh, that was confusing. I think I died on my own cluster mine there. Now, I'm not trying to steal that guy's stuff, but I didn't realize he was still there. Grandpa doesn't take other people's stuff unless it's the enemy. Yeah, this, this weapon and the sight's not obnoxious. I didn't like the bare bones sight because I don't like big sights on sniper weapons. Comment if... You also don't prefer the big sites. Now, if we're on a like derailment, a, a large map, I'll put a 8x scope. Oh, that was a no scope there. I'll put an 8x sight on it because you you have to because you can't see across the map. What is what's going on here? We got an iron back that's trying to hide from this guy. I just take him out for him, save him. It's close game. Grandpa's taking a taking a rest there. It's like a good spot up in the time I bought the farm. Grandpa's about halfway down the leaderboard there, but it, leaderboard we all have about the same amount of kills. In fact, I think Grandpa on this one has more, and it's Team Deathmatch. What is this guy doing? He dancing? He break dancing? He's got on a sequin leotard set there. That's a bit odd. But to each their own. Just tell him I love him with a Renetti SMG pistol. <laughs> yeah, there's, there's the incredible eraser. Throw out the cluster mine, see if we can do some more sniping. This is why I don't use marksman gloves as much, because I like to change out to the Renetti really quickly. I, w I like to change between sniper and weapon, and I don't have but one bullet. But we win. Hey, I think the configuration is awesome. If you enjoyed the video, please like, subscribe. Helps me, helps the family. Thank you for the folks who helped get me monetized. Peace to you, and have a wonderful weekend. Call of Duty Championships this weekend. They start today. So have a look at that. Peace.